What happens if we mix these two types of glue? Recently I did a video testing lots of types of glue versus a non-stick pan, and several people asked to see what would happen if we mixed some. So let's find out. This right here is a thick super glue. A nice coating. Super glue. Now E6000. And a mix. I'll try and get about the same volume of each glue. And we'll mix it together and apply it to our cardboard. The two don't really seem to want to mix very evenly. We're getting a weird sort of gelatinous structure here. All right, here's our weird gel. Just to give them the best possible chance, we're gonna let that cure overnight. Well, our glue has had time to dry. Let's see how it did. Okay, so our E6000, how is this connection? It pulled apart. Oh, it didn't pull apart the glue. It tore the cardboard. Got a good hold, kind of rubbery. As you'd expect from E6000. Super glue. Uh, that kind of tore just the very, very surface of the cardboard. Much more rigid hold, like you'd expect from super glue. And our mix. Tore the same way the E6000 did, and it's holding together. It kind of holds together. It's not rubbery and it's not hard. It's just kind of a soft plastic. So can you mix these two? Yeah, it turns into a sort of weird boogery mess that's really hard to apply to anything. So did it work? Yeah, but would you want to? I don't see why you would. 